hey fam welcome back to my channel thank you so much for stopping by if you're new here or you just seen my video for the first time my name is abigail ifoma i hope you enjoyed today's video today i'll be sharing with you how i achieved this week from the beginning to the end i hope you enjoyed the video and you stay tuned to the end all right guys let's get right into the video to start with you'll be needing your hair so this is the hair i'm using it comes in three parts and in one closure i'll be using my neat and um, wig cap and then place it on the dummy's head after doing that i'll get my closure the closure that came with the hair i'll just put it on the mannequin's head i'll bring it like an half an inch forward to the net and then just secure it with my pin and start sewing it round with my needle and thread i'm sewing it twice i'll be sewing it round twice that's the closure net i'll be sewing it round twice with my needle and thread So at this point, I finished sewing the first line. So I will go back one more time and sew it round. So that makes it twice. So I'm sewing the closure net twice with my needle and thread. so at this point i'm done sewing it round twice i'll just go ahead and cut it out with my scissors after cutting out with my scissors i'll secure the end by tying a knot twice so you can go ahead and do it like three times or two times and then cut it out with the scissors after sewing with my needle and thread here is how the looking like so i'll just go ahead and place my tape on the net and then start using my candle to create the line each of the line they are one inch gap so i'll just go ahead and then just create the line with my candle this line is just like a guide where i can sew my weave on I never really asked to be brought into this place You wanna love me, well then baby have a taste All the highs and the lows, no you'll never be the same I don't really wanna hurt you but I So at this point I'm done and here is how it's looking like I'll just take my hair to the machine Okay, okay maybe you could be the change I need today I promise that I've never felt this way I really hope that you will choose to stay through all the pain so i'm fold i folded the air into two after folding the air into two i will put the machine on zigzag after putting the machine on zigzag mode i will just start sewing it So we are done sewing the three parts of the week so I'm just going to go ahead and place it on my neck and start sewing the method I'm using I'm using a zigzag um, method to sew 
you just want to go ahead and then start sewing it on your net you'll be doing it line by lines and this is how it's going to come out so neat and very very neat so i'm using zigzag method like i said i'll go ahead and then start sewing that's how i'll be keep doing it until i get to the top where the closure net is at this point we are done sewing the other part of the net so here is very close to the clo where the closure net is the last line so we want to do it to be very close as possible and then start sewing it like very very close as possible as you can see they are very close to each other so I'll just go ahead and then sew it as well. So this is what the air is looking like, very close to the closure. The, the excess net, I will just cut it out with my scissors as well. After cutting it out, this is how it's going to look like. I will just go ahead and place it on my mannequin's head. So here is how it is now. I'm ready to style. So here is me putting water on the air with a little bit of oil. I'm just going to go ahead and spray it with. So after spraying, I will take my coily series and just put it around my hair and and just rub it on the air after doing that i'll go ahead and add my moons after adding my moons i'll put it in on the wick as well so here is me trying to style it just want to go ahead and then just give it a touch after that you go ahead and comb it out if you want it to be too full you just go ahead and comb it out so at this point i'm trying to create the center part to be very clear and then just comb it so here is how it's looking like after combing it out i'll go ahead as well and use my hot comb and then define the closure just to make it very flat So at this point you can just go ahead and style it the way you want. So after styling, this is what the air is looking like. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video please don't forget to subscribe if you haven't if you've watched up to this time and you haven't subscribed please what are you waiting for go ahead and hit the subscribe button like comment down below let me know where you're watching from if you're new to the channel also let me know at the comment section so i can give you a warm welcome 